Today, we're going to be doing the best stumble guys challenge ever. Where the maps, the emotes, the skins, and even the prize will be better than ever before. If you win a game, you get to pick one skin for free. And it can be absolutely anything. We're going to do 10 different games, so let's see what they win. And how else could we possibly start this video without Block Dash? We got three rounds of Block Dash. We got normal Block Dash, then we got legendary Block Dash. And finally, Laser Dash for finals. And for this first game we only have punch kick and hug equipped and if you didn't know now we have like 19 different emotes in the game so it's crazy where uh stubble guys has come to but i believe the original three are the most versatile and well executed emotes in the game let me know if you guys agree but we will switch it up over the course of this challenge let's also take note of everyone's favorite skins it looks to be pretty well mixed between super flashy and like Try hard pro i'm not sure if they're all planning this together but everyone's using the yellow mr stumble okay i gotta clutch up sorry that was definitely something <laughs> rip to that guy oh no um i have to clutch again can i do it no why did i dive i got the dive glitch but like I was saying, a lot of these players are using gold skins, which personally, the gold sensei is my favorite. All right, we're now to the TNT. And as you'll notice, this game is going on quite long just because I took off a lot of the overpowered emotes. Ooh, a lot of people are going to have to clutch. Oh, that's four people just gone immediately. The TNT is going to get out at least two. There's one. Is there a second one out too? <gasps> Only got out a single person. That was a huge clutch. Riz? Wait, he's insane. Riot is probably looking to be eliminated here. Can he clutch? Oh, he's him. All right, we're now in finals. Laser dash. Oh, that guy just hopped over his kick. I think my money is on Finley here. He does have the height advantage. Goes for the body block. Now he has to clutch. Is he able to? No, the laser gets him. Finley winning our first game. Let's see what skin he picks. And Finley is taking the hot gloves McLove. Let's go on to game two. Game number two, we're starting it out on Super Slide, which I think is everyone's favorite race map. At least it's mine. It's just so nostalgic. <gasps> how am I still alive? Um, we're playing with no emotes this round. So let's see how this goes. We just have to be top 16. Top 16. Come on. Here we go. Oh, what a last second effort. Big and wait, are we top 10? easy and next we got my favorite elib map we got laser tracer and again no emotes so this will last a while so editor do your thing and speed this up Dang it! Oh! I had so little room there. And finals, we got Lava Land. So again, this is going to take quite a long time. But let's see how this plays out. If you do not know, you can still get people out, but you have to body block them. So it's going to be interesting to see if anyone's able to do it when the stakes are at its highest. I'm very interested why the first person took Hot Gloves Micklove. Because I don't even think it's that cool. But maybe it's like a tryhard skin. We are about two minutes into finals and not a single person has slipped off. It's going to go down to the wire. Play 3D is actually so patient right now. I could see him winning this entire thing. Would that be back-to-back -back Rainbow Liquid wins? That would be crazy. Could he do it? Again. We got T-Bones in here as well. Not able to get enough momentum. Okay, it's YY versus T-Bodes. Two of the best players in my Discord. Who takes it? Oh, the last second, YY. And YY chose level 255, which is a very good choice because this was only in a bundle, I believe. Not sure how much it was, but this one is sick. Up next, we're playing the brand new Yeti Yeats map that I've never played with actual people before. We only got special skins in here. All right, and I am using probably the most expensive skin in Stumble, guys, because this came from, I believe, like a $50 bundle on Black Friday. So I'm surprised no one's picked this yet. Dude, we're literally just building a wall. I wonder if we could blockade all the uh, boulders. I don't know if it would be possible, but it would be funny. Oh, no. The wind is kicking in. This is where it starts to get interesting. Oh, no. Okay. Everything's great. Relax. Okay. Cool. 
Oh no, I'm dead. How does that happen, bro? Let's see how pro level gameplay looks on the Yeti map. You gotta be very cautious of what's behind you because if you get too close to the ledge, you're just gonna be sucked into it like I did. Oh, and it's now 1v1. Trent versus Pablo. This is like the final, final wave. I've never seen it go this far. Oh, no, Trent's out. Trent is so dead. How is he alive right now? He's so lucky. Oh, Pablo's out. Yep, that's GG. <gasps> that's nuts. How is he not getting pushed? He's still alive. <laughs> oh! He glitched through the map? He's gotta be so mad right now. And Pablo takes Dark Fire Fist. I think this is the most underrated special. I'm not sure if this one's a hot take or not, but this is one of my favorite maps. We got Bucket Mayhem. So it's just one round. Obviously, we got 32 players in here, but I'm going to get out for sure early on, especially with all emotes turned off. This is not a good luck for me. Uh, Don't come after me. Yo, chill, 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 chill. No, please. I'm begging you. Oh, stay back. Stop targeting. No, wait. How am I alive? How am I alive right now? How? Oh, no! Please, please, please! Okay, we're good. Dive back. I'm him! No! Dang it! <laughs> Surely one's over here, yep. You're dead. Nope. What? How did I not touch him? Oh, he was so close to winning. And the fourth winner took the diamond KO skin. This one's the flashiest skin in the game, I swear. We are halfway through this challenge. We got game number five starting things out on Lost Temple. And no emotes are turned on for this as well. Feels like OG stumble, guys. I think a lot of people miss the old days when you could just like play without having to worry about 20 different things hitting you. Next up, we got Honey Drop. This one's kind of on the fence, but I do want to mix up the maps a little bit. So if we only wanted to have the best of the best, like obviously, Obviously, it would be just... What? How did I die? I just infinitely fell. Unlucky. Honey drop is going to go by very quickly. Everyone's on the outside edge. Pizza's going to be probably in the winning position here. <gasps> he falls early. Did he die? Why did he jump so early? I have several questions. Not sure, but he's still in. And now we have the... Uh, First, like, real try-hard race map. We got Lava Rush. I remember when I thought this was the hardest level in the game, which I still kind of stand by that. We got T-Bones and Pizza Planet going head-to-head. -head. I don't think there's a way that Pizza can catch up here. And as long as he doesn't get hit by the fireball, <gasps> Pizza gets hit. All right, T-Bones taking game five. And that's back-to-back -back people that took the Diamond KO skin. Okay, this one's gonna be interesting. We got Shark Muta with all emotes turned on. I gotta stay towards the center, otherwise I'm the first one to go. Let's go ahead and go invisible. Run away, run away, run away. Please do not target me. Please do not target me. Oh my god. I think I body blocked that guy into dying. Stay alive, stay alive, please. Oh god. Yes! Thank goodness he did not punch me. Shout out to whoever that SpongeBob is. Next, we got Jungle Roll, and I feel like this is one of the better race maps. People prefer limb maps, but I wanted to throw in both. We also have all emotes turned on, so volleyball definitely gonna be busted here. Sucks to suck if you don't have it turned on. And that guy, you are dead to me. I'm tempted to turn around and punch him, but we still should qualify regardless. And there we go. This is my first time making it to finals in this video, and I don't know that I'm all that confident. Rush Hour is one of my favorite ELIM maps, so we do have a small chance. I think this is a hot take, but invisibility kind of ruins Stumble Guys in a weird way. Obviously, it helps me because I can now survive longer. Uh, but... For the average person, it probably makes the experience worse. I thought that pop-up was able to send me to the next platform. Oh, wow. He really did it to him. Oh, <gasps> no, he's fine. Go. Wow. wow. Barely being sucked into the void. Why, why? Taking another game. And after winning for the second time, he decides to take this skin. I mean, it's kind of cool, but out of every single one, we literally went from the most expensive skin you could possibly pick to one of the least. I didn't even get done with my YouTube transition.
Uh, we're playing the other side and it's only banana. So <laughs> this should be way more interesting than if it was punch only or kick as well. We're in the top 10. And I asked them what's their favorite Elim map, and a lot of people said Acid Pool. These players have really gotten good at this map. I haven't played it much at all, but the fact that they're all still living... Oh, I jinxed him. There's like three people that just went down at that exact instant. Oh, no. Ethan gets pushed off. Mr. Virus versus Kareem. Mr. Virus. Mr. Virus is taking the Kansas City Chiefs, which they actually are back-to-back -back Super Bowl winners. Maybe he just wants the exclusivity of this skin because you can't get it anymore, really. And here's what the skin looks like in-game if you've never seen it. Uh, but yeah, it has that red glow effect to it. But now we're playing the other side, which this was also showcased in my the worst video ever in Stubble Guys. And the reason I showed it last time is because it has five lives. Purely the reason it's in this video is because I love the gameplay. It just lasts forever. Wait, someone died already? How do you die five times? But yeah, this is one of the best limb maps. And it's not all that glitchy, to be honest. So no emotes are turned on. So this should speed up the game a little. Oh, watch that TNT. We're gonna have to go off this car. Oh, no! Wait, what did I get hit by? I honestly should look at my inventory see and see what <gasps> skin I would have chose if I win. Oh, we gotta go right. Go right, go right, go right. Off this car. Perfect timing. Okay. Left. No! Please! That's so unlucky. Nice. Good dive. Oh, no. Oh, huge! Wait, I'm popping off right now. Oh, no. I'm popping off right now. Please send me. Yes. Good. No! Please! Dang it. I was saying if it doesn't send me well, I'm just dead. We have two lives left. We could have won this entire thing. And we're to the time limit. This is some of the sweatiest other side I've ever seen. All right. We got T-Bones, YY King. Wow. Just ends like it's nothing. And why, why with the third game? People are on some weird stuff today. Why, why picks the Chiefs again? So he's won three games. And out of all 10, we have two people taking home this skin. Game number nine. And starting things out for the first round. Oh my gosh. We got Tetris. Um, we only have Spit Equipped, which is kind of a troll, if I'm being honest. I've run out of uh, good emotes, if you will. Oh, <laughs> no. You! Mm. Up next, we got Bot Bash, which I feel like isn't the best of the best, but it's also not bad. It's just kind of in the middle. In my opinion, Acid Pool is way better than Bot Bash. It's just a more intense version of this, basically. It was a good map before Taunt was busted. I'll put it out there like that, but ever since they added the Taunt mechanic, it just ruins the entire level. And this might be controversial as well, but I think this is one of the best Elim maps. It is kind of a pay-to-win map, but hey, let's see if these people are going to use Spit. Trent tried to. Nope. Ooh, barely avoiding it there. We have quite a few people actually utilizing it. Wow. YY gets an Elim as well. Lucas is out. Wait, it did it. I think it got both of them out. Oh my god. What is happening? We got T-Bones versus Ryan God. What? What just happened there? Here we go. <laughs> I know I was saying there's no dumb mechanics, but it might be busted. <laughs> All right. What? Just happened. And T-Bones is taking 255 again. I don't know why people are only picking like three different options, but hey. And here we are with the last game. We're doing all emotes, and we picked my favorite three Elim maps. So we got Block Dash Legendary, then going into Lava Land, and for finals, we have Laser Tracer. If you guys don't like those maps, you don't like Stumble, guys. Let's be honest. We might actually qualify. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Please. Oh, my God. How are we alive right now? They can't see me. What? Please. Dive, 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 dive. Kick. Let's go in the second round. Lock in, lock in, lock in, lock in. Don't hit me, don't hit me. Just think about the skins you guys can win, all right? Just separate myself, hide. Oh no. What was that? It blocked me! This map sucks. Take it out of the game. <laughs> and for finals, we have the best map in all of Stubble Guys, Laser Tracer. They should make a Laser Tracer 2.0 besides a Laser Dash, okay? Two people gone. Ooh, Trent with a crazy kick there. I don't know what this disappearing name glitch is, but it's annoying because I can't even commentate. We have Trent over here. <gasps> he was invisible. He didn't even mean to do that. Oh, what? 
He read that so well. Trent is so good. What was that? All right, let's see what Trent is taking for the final skin. And yet again, we have another person taking level 255. Let me know if this is your favorite skin down in the comments. But if I had to pick one skin to get for myself, what would it be? I mean, I have every skin besides the ones you see here. Out of all these, I need the Flying Dutchman still. I'm very mad that I didn't finish the tournament rewards when it came out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure you have code Baby Yoda in the item shop so I can do challenges like this in the future. And if you want to be a part of these videos, the Discord link will be down below. See you guys next time. Goodbye.